Hello, students. Good evening. Good evening. How are you? Good. You are doing good. That's fantastic. Well, welcome to another day, another class. It is a pleasure for me to be here with you once again. So, everybody's connecting. That's fantastic. We're going to wait for the rest of your friends to connect and we can go over the class. So how was your day? What did you do during the day? Work, 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 work. What did you do today? Hello. Hello. Okay, let me see. I am going to start sharing my screen with everybody. So, uh, yeah, there are many people connected already. 16 people. Hello, Fatima. Hello, Santos. Hello, Jaime. Hello, Hello. Maria. It's a pleasure to see you. Good evening. Good evening. The pleasure is me. It's a pleasure to see you once again. It is great to have you in another class. So, excellent. We have 17 participants and they are more and more connecting. Very good. So, I am going to start sharing my screen. So, let me know when you can see it. Good. Okay. Can you see my screen? Yes, say welcome. Excellent. Hello, Maria Delia. Welcome. Hello, Claudia. I can Hello, see you. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello. Hello to the ones that are in the gas station. Okay, sorry. Hello. Good evening. Hello, hello. Well, so we're going to go over uh, the agreements. Remember, practice your English. Remember, advance in the platform. Uh, attend your classes and keep your cameras active all the time because it helps us to interact better when we can actually see each other. Right? It is very important that uh, we can see, we can see each other and we can actually interact and participate together. Any difficulty with the educational platform? No? Any question? Any difficulty? Nothing? My dear students, I cannot listen to you. Until no now. Until now, no. Remember? May maybe in two hours. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, no, no. Remember that uh, by this time, you should have finished uh, section three. We are almost done, section three, and uh, we, are, we should be starting section four. According to the, to the different definitions that I sent you, right? ¿Se acuerdan la división que les envié de, 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 los, de las secciones? Entonces creo que lo tenemos que ir siguiendo, no se nos olvide. Eh, para esta semana ya tendríamos que haber completado, veamos. Chun, chun, chun. Section 3 should be completed. Section 3 should be completed. And you should be starting section 4. And remember that you can advance all that you want. Ok, si ustedes ya la terminaron. Fantástico. You, we can just continue checking during the process. Okay, so it is always it is always good that you keep practicing, that you keep working on everything as much as possible. Well, today we are going to study comparatives. Okay, we're going to study comparatives. What did you investigate about the topic? Did you investigate anything about the topic? Uh -huh. No, yes, no. It's okay if you didn't because we're going to study that today. No one, one, two, three, four, quien nomás, nadie. I don't know but I think Uh-huh. I'm sorry. 
Okay, I, I, I just lost you a little bit. It's about, it's about person, for example, animal. Uh huh. You can you can compare person. You can compare people in this case. People, animals, things, and uh, in this case, clothes, right? Clothes or clothing. Uh, you can also compare it, right? As well. We're going to study that today. Don't worry. So. We're going to start with uh, this first question. In the previous class, what were we studying yesterday? Comparatives. Uh -huh, we started with comparatives. What else did we do? Ajá, ahorita todos a revisar el cuaderno, right? Ajá. Take notes, remember to take notes, because if not, in the next class you are like, what, 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 I don't remember. About the elements. Exactly, elements and different types of? That we talk about plastic, metal, gold, rubber. What is that? Okay. materials materials right we studied about materials good so to catch up on this class to start like putting all the feeling and the focus on the class and all the things that we are going to do remember adjectives that you know adjectives that you know adjectives is something that you study maybe in basic english like three or four modules ago uh, you should have studied adjectives, adjectives to describe things, adjectives to describe people, places, uh, materials, objects in general. So what are some adjectives that you know? Let's see, let's make here a little collection of adjectives. Pretty? Mm. Okay, one, one by one. And if you want, if you want to advance, we can also write them on the chat. Uh huh. You say pretty, okay? Pretty. <laughs> pretty. Uh -huh. Elegant. Elegant. Good. Another one. Tall. Tall. Uh -huh. Big. Big. What is the other one? I heard one. Dangerous. 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 Which one, Ciro? Good. Good. Small. Good. Small. Uh huh. Short. Short. Easy. Um, Easy. Good. Intelligent. Intelligent. What? Serious. Serious. What? Like teacher Nati. <laughs> no. Serious. Uh, smiling. Smiley. What? Smiley. Okay, smiley, smiley. Wonderful. Nice. Wonderful. Oh, thank you, Vivi. I think that I feel that you are describing me. Ah. <laughs> Wonderful, another one. Nice. 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 Remember the chat. You can send also your answers in the chat. Uh -huh. nice. Exciting. Fast. Fast. Exciting, fast, good, exciting. Happy, happy. strong. Exciting, it's fast, good, happy. happy. Sad. Happy, sad. Hmm. Strong teacher. Strong, good, very good. Yes. Good. <laughs> hey. I have good right there. Uh huh. Strong. Which one, Ana Maria? Eh, um, Little. ¿Cómo se pronuncia servicial en inglés? Help. Ah. Helpful. It can be kind or helpful. Little. Little. Uh -huh. Any other one? Let's see on the chat what we have. On the chat, strong. we have a strong, busy, clever. Hey, busy and clever. That's good. Busy and clever. 
busy, clever. What else? Hard. Interesting. Hard. Interesting. Good. Active. Active. Attractive. Near. Attractive. Attractive. Uh -huh. Beautiful. I I lost the 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 art. Wait 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 wait. Attractive. Uh huh. Beautiful. Beautiful. I think beautiful. We have it already. No. No, we don't have beautiful. Okay, so we're going to write beautiful. Wonderful. Beautiful. Wonderful. Near. De cerca. Okay, near. Wonderful. Yes. Which one? Para. Open. Open. <laughs> open. Well, open is a in in this case a verb. It's an it's a verb. Bar. And sweet. Okay. Sweet. Sweet. Very good. <laughs> sweet. Any other one? Or do you think it's enough with this one? Handsome. Handsome. Good for the boys, right? Handsome. And for this one, you can also have good looking. Good looking, it means bien parecido. Good looking. Warm. 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 I think, okay, we don't have it. Warm. Uh -huh. Warm. Hot. Cold. Hot. Good. Difficult. Difficult. Very good. Difficult. Boring. And boring. Okay, boring. Okay, so I think we have enough. We have enough. If, oh, we have more in the chat. Let's see. Let's see the ones that we have in the chat. Uh, okay, Rosa Maria has difficulties to listen. Okay. Can you listen to me now, Rosa Maria? No? Okay. Uh, me cuesta mucho, teacher. Aquí está lloviendo super fuerte. Ah, okay. So so try to, try to keep it there, very close to you. So VC, clever. Course, what is the meaning of course? Creepy, creepy, ooh, creamy, bossy, bossy is mandong, right? Amazing, good, bold, bright, expensive, expensive, it's another good one. And modern, right? Expensive and modern. I am going to add these two just to, to finish here. Expensive and modern. Expensive and modern. Okay, so good. These are the ones that you created, right? I didn't invent them. You created your list of adjectives. You are going to use them later on. And you're going to say, ¿Cuánto dijimos? Hubiéramos dicho menos, you say. This is your list. You created it. So you created your list. <laughs> there you go. Excellent. I'm going to, left, to leave you there on 40. That's pretty good. Great. So all these are adjectives adjectives are used to describe things for example if you are going to describe a friend in the class you can say well i am going to describe a uh, claudia claudia it's very beautiful she is very intelligent very elegant very kind helpful uh, attractive sweet etc 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 but if you come and compare and you tell me, aha, but I am going to compare Maria and Claudia. And you are like, hmm, ha. If you say, Maria is taller than Claudia. Es más alta. I don't know. I am just inventing, right? Sí. Yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> or, very tall. <laughs> if you say, for example, um, Claudia is more, uh, what? Let's see more, uh, she's more serious than Maria, <laughs> right? It would be like, hmm, the two of you very serious, right? Very serious. <laughs> and let me see if I imagine that you compare Maria and the teacher and you say, no, Maria is uh, more stylish than the teacher, right? And uh, if you say like, for example, uh, 
social studies class, it's a little bit more boring than uh, English class. And that is the way that you can use these things to compare when you have two things. For example, if you compare cats and dogs, which adjectives would you use? For example, bigger. Aha. Uh -huh. So how how do you make the comparison? The dog is bigger than the cat. Okay, the dog is bigger than the cat. Mm -hmm. I can say the cat is more intelligent than the dog. <laughs> right? Or you can say, no, 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 teacher is in the contrary. The dog is more intelligent than the cat right? Cats are more interesting than the dogs, right? And then you can continue making more and more comparisons. <coughs> Today, we are going to learn how to transform the different adjectives in the specific form of the comparatives, okay? We are going to go with the first rule of the night. Here, adding ER to the comparative, and in this one we have, Barry is taller than Eric. Okay, like in the picture, Eric is shorter than Barry. In the normal adjectives, it says like the most common form is that you add ER to the adjective. Okay, and when you add ER to it, you make a comparative form, right? Long, longer, dark, darker, bright, brighter, quick, quicker, warm, warmer. It's like caliente, eh, más caliente que, right? Young, younger, más joven que. Strong, stronger, okay? Eh, Popeye is stronger than the rock. Smart, smarter, right? Smart. Weak, devil, weak, weaker. So if you are weak, normally, and if you get chikungunya, you get weaker. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> all right, you get weaker. <laughs> uh, neat, neater, neat is organized, okay? Organized and clean. Cold, colder, and old, older. So this is the shortest form on which you add only ER to the verb, right? To some of the verbs, because later on we have some specific classes of adjectives. So for these ones, no problem, you add only ER. They finish in consonants, no problem, you add ER to the adjective. But what happens with the other forms? Here, okay, I, I play so hard here. In the other forms, the next form that we have, it says, Adding ER to one syllable adjectives that end in a single vowel or a single consonant. The example that I have, Harold's clothes could not possible be weather. Weather means, okay, wet means mojado, but weather, it's mucho más mojado. And what is the difference that we make here? Empapado, Empapado exactly like that. What is the difference that in this one, you have to write a double consonant, right? You have to write a double consonant to make the adjective. And in this one, you have the adjective big, but to make the comparative, you say another consonant, ER, okay? Fat, fatter. Hot, hotter. Modern. Sad, sadder. Mad, manner, mother, Modern. sorry, and thing, thinner. thinner. In yeah. these ones, you have yeah. consonante, vocal, consonante. Okay? Si tienen esa combinación en el adjetivo, consonante, vocal, consonante, you have to write another consonant and ER, right? And you make the comparative forms. Okay? You have big, bigger, fatter, uh, hotter, sadder, madder, thinner. And this one, the meaning will be like grande, más grande, right? Is it clear? ¿Nos queda claro este segundo punto? Yes. 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 Okay. okay, let's go to the next one. Let's go to the next one. Not like horchata, right? Clear as water. In the next one. This one is when the adjectives finish in Y. When the adjectives finish in Y. 
And what is the grammar form? It says, adding ER to an adjective that ends in Y. When the adjective ends in Y, you must, you must change the Y to I and add ER. In this case, only ER, because we're not checking comparatives now to form the comparative uh, of the adjective, okay? That was the funniest thing I have ever heard. Why? Because funny ends up with why, the normal adjective. And to make a comparative, you change it for I-E-S-T. How do you make the examples? Pretty, prettier. Angry, like angry birds, angrier. Shampoo. Happy, Nothing. happier. Busy, happier. busier. Lovely, Lovely. Busier. lovelier. Lovely. Silly, sillier. sillier. Sleepy, sleepier. Thirsty, thirstier. 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 Ugly, Ugly. Uglier. uglier. Do you know the meaning of all of them? Prettier. Más bonito. Bonito. Yeah, prettier is like más bonito. Uh -huh. Angry, más enojado. Exactly like that. Uglier is... is... Más feliz. No. Más, ser, más ocupado. Low, lowlier. Más enamorado. Más... Más querido. <laughs> Más querido. <laughs> Más querido. Estoy... Sillier. I don't know. I, I don't know. What is the meaning about the sillier? <laughs> No se escucha. Teacher, okay. tiene desactivado el audio. And that's the secret of eternal happiness. <laughs> Ese es el secreto de la felicidad. Gracias a todos por su atención. <laughs> kidding. So, sorry. Um, I was explaining that lovely means amoroso, right? Amoroso o más amoroso. Silly is the feeling that you get when you fall in love. How do you act when you fall in love? You are like embobado. You're like, ah. Ah. <laughs> everything is perfect. Everything is beautiful. And when you fall in love, it's sillier. It's the, the double thing, right? It's like, si estaba embobado, sillier, it's like the double thing, <laughs> right? <laughs> Me han contado, right? it, it, they, they said, I don't know. <laughs> A sleepier is, uh, well, a sleepy, the feeling of being a sleepy is when you are like, no, ah, uh -huh, somnoliento, right? Thirsty, when you want to drink water, thirsty. And no, yeah, thirstier, it's like when you compare. Ugly, uglier, right? Más feo. Re feo. <laughs> <laughs> you, were, you were not ugly. You are uglier than, than the rest, you say. Re feo. Okay. The next one. Let's go here. For this one is when the adjectives end in E. All the adjectives that end in E, you just have to add the R. Don't add ER to this one. You don't say closer. No. You say only the R. Closer. Wiser. Stranger. Uh, hugger, we're huge, huge, huger, 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 rude, ruder, loose, loser, safe, safer, cut, cute, cuter, gentle, gentler, simple, simpler. Right? If the adjective ends in E, only add the R. Okay? Don't add anything else, just the R. Okay? 
Good, that it's the next rule. There are many rules for this one. For the long adjectives, right? For the long adjectives, the ones that have more than two syllables. You have to use more. More interesting, more complete, more beautiful, more important, more dangerous, more colorful, more exciting. Something that you have to be very careful about. If you put more, don't add ER, okay? Don't say more beautifuler because that is a total mistake. It's like, eh, no, right? No, no, no. You say more, more beautiful, more important, more colorful, more exciting, more complicated, more boring, okay? So this is something very important. The example, Karen is the most honest person I know, okay? For the long adjectives with more than two syllables, just add more. The next one, I think it's the last one. And these are special cases. Special cases of adjectives uh, that we have here are good, in the comparative form is better. Bad, worst. Well, better, it's the same, right? Good and well are the same. Uh, they have the same form of comparative. And far, farther or further, right? And the example that I have, this pillow is much better. You don't say gooder, please. Nunca digan gooder. Eso es totally incorrect or more good, or more bad, no, 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 right? This is a no, 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 total no, no, no. The pillow is much better. What is the comparative form of good? Better. What is better. the comparative of bad? Worse. 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 What is the comparative for well? Better. 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 What is the comparative for far? Excellent, excellent job, okay? For you not to get confused. Don't get confused. And here I have a practice. Now that we have studied the different uh, comparative forms and everything, we are going to make the practice. Now I need you to analyze the two cases and we are going to change the forms of the adjectives into the comparative form. Something very crucial or very important to remember is the form of the adjective that you say. Uh, imagine that you are talking about a cheap. You say it's cheaper, cheaper than. Cheaper than it's because it means it's más barato que, because you are comparing. Mm -hmm. It is a bigger than, you say. So the word than, it is going to make the times of que, right? You say it's bigger than, okay? So this is a very good friend of the comparatives. When you say he is bigger than. So what about here? Which dress is? Prettier. Aha. Uh -huh. In the questions, that was the next thing that I was going to say. In the questions, you cannot say prettier than because uh, you are offering the two options. Which dress is prettier? I'm going to write it here. Which dress is prettier? The yellow one or the green one? Well, the green one is silk and silk is more expensive than polyester. Exactly. More expensive Teacher. than polyester. Yes. Sure polyester. No me queda claro el uso del dan. Okay. <clears throat> The use of then is, for example, when you are doing this type of things, when you are comparing two things and when you have two objects. And if I say, for example, uh, the blue marker is better than the pink one. 
eh, el uso de dan hace las veces de qué en español. Cuando decimos este sí. es más bonito que uh -huh. este. Because you use it when you compare, right? Este es más lindo que este. So in the case of then, when you are comparing two things, you are going to say, oh no, this one is more expensive than this one. Okay, so that is the use of then. Mm, but okay. in the first question that you have there, you cannot say this dress is prettier than. Porque ahí no estamos prettier. haciendo la comparación. Ahí estamos haciendo una pregunta. ¿De qué estamos que comparando? Es uh -huh. Which dress is prettier? Uh -huh. The yellow one or the green one? Okay, in this case is, okay. ¿cuál es más bonito? Okay, okay that's the use. Eh, in the second exercise, okay. can you work in the second exercise and you can give me your, your answers? Share it. Exactly, very good job. In this case, yes, you are comparing, right? Is this blue t-shirt larger than the red and white one? No, the red and white no, one. The red one is bigger. Is bigger. Is bigger. It's bigger than. Uh -huh. no, the sentence ends up there. Ahí bigger. Está valoración. Uh -huh. It's bigger. Uh -huh. It's, It's a, a medium. medium. The blue the one blue is a small. Is a small. Mm -hmm. Okay, let me see. Uh, okay, Edwin is in his car. Can you participate, Edwin? Yes. Yeah. Which dress is prettier, the yellow one or the green one? The, the green one is silk. And silk? Um, and silk is more expensive than polyester. Excellent, very good job. Thank you, because you are in the middle of traffic, but you are there, that's cool. Let's see, okay. Maria Delia. Maria Delia, is okay. this blue t-shirt larger than the red and white one? No, the red and white one is bigger. It's a medium. It's a medium. Uh -huh. The blue one is a small. Excellent job. Very good job. Let's see. Sandra Maritza, which dress is prettier? The yellow one or the green one? Me dijo a mí. Sí. Yes, Sandra Maritza, yes. Es que no le escuché mucho y se me cortó algo. Oh, don't ¿Me worry. Puedes repetir, por favor. Which dress is prettier, the yellow one or the green one? The first exercise, the first exercise, Sandrita. El primero. The first exercise. Sería, uh, where the green one is silk, está bien? Yes, yes. And silk is more expensive than yes. polyester. Excellent job, very good. Rosa, is this blue t-shirt larger than the red and white one? No, the, no, the red and the white one is bigger, big in the middle, in the medium, the blue one is five. Excellent job, very good, Rosita, excellent, very nice. So let's go with the last exercise. And this one, you are going to do it alone. I am not going to help you with this one. We have cotton and wool. Complete the next exercise. I am not going to help you with this one, go ahead. Look I at think. the pants, which one do you like better? Exactly. Better. Better. Mm -hmm. Which ones do you like better? <laughs> Hello, sweetie. <laughs> What about the next one? Yeah, don't worry, Renee. I, I, I have kids too, and it happens. <laughs> and in letter B, I prefer the green cotton ones. They are? Yes. 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 
more stylish, stylish than. More stylish than. More stylish than the wool ones. Very good job. Let's see. Katherine Alejandra, can you help me with this one? Look at these pants. Which ones do you like better? I prefer to greet cotton ones. They are most stylish than the wool ones. Excellent, very good job. Let's see, Santos, look at these pants. Which ones do you like better? Hmm. I prefer the green coral ones. I than the wool ones. Fantastic, Mr. Jaime, look at these pants. Which ones do you like better? I prefer the green coral ones. They're more stylish than the wool ones. Excellent. Mr. William, look at these pants. Which ones do you like better? I prefer the green Excellent. I think I, I can listen to rain all over El Salvador. Alicia, look at these pants. Which ones do you like better? I prefer the green cotton ones. They're more stylish than the wool ones. Excellent. Let's see the last participation. Mr. Luis Monzon, go ahead. Look at these pants. Which ones do you like better? I prefer the green cons. ¿Cómo se pronuncia esa palabra? Después cotton. De green. Cotton. cotton. I prefer the green cotton ones. They are more stylish than the wool ones. Excellent, very good job. Very, very, very excellent job, everybody. So, let me see. I need two volunteers for the first ones. Two volunteers. Me? Okay, I have, let me see. Oi, where are you? Okay, me. Catherine and? Me. Maria Delia. Okay. Okay, okay. Let, let me erase here. Okay, do the first conversation. Okay, which dress is pretty? The yellow one or the green one? Well, the green one is thick and the thick is more expensive for polyester. It's more expensive than polyester. Very good job. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Now I need other two volunteers. I need other two volunteers. Jaime and who else? Mr. Jaime and Ana Maria, thank you very much. The, Go ahead. The second, the second, the second exercise? Yes, or, the second exercise. Yes. Uh, what friends is... No, the one that says, is this blue t-shirt? One dress is the yellow. ¿Cuál es la, perdón, teacher, la, la de, la dos? We are going to go with the one about the shirts. Is this blue t-shirt? Is this blue t-shirt? Um, uh -huh. Larger. Larger than red and white one. Uh -huh. No, the red and white one is bigger. Uh -huh. It's a medium. The blue one is, is a small. Excellent. Very good job. Very, very, very good job. Thank you, Ana Maria and Jaime. Let's go with, let me see, Tania and Paola. Number three. Uh, look at these pants. Which ones do you like better? Okay. I prefer the green cotton ones. They're stylish, the wool ones. They are more stylish than the wool ones. Excellent job. Thank you very much to all my participants and my volunteers. That was excellent. 
Now, this is a moment for you to go and become creative. I need you please to take a picture to the screen because we are going to make mini groups of work. We are going to make little couples. And what we are going to do is that you are going to create original sentences, okay? You are going to create original sentences with your group and you are going to come and present them when we come back, okay? So right now I need you to take a picture to the screen because I am going to send you to mini groups and you are going to create original sentences. Okay, do you have the picture of it? Yes? Yes. Excellent. So we are going to go to a small rooms of four people and you are going to uh, create sentences, okay? <laughs> so I am going to, okay. I am going to invite you right now and please make sure that you complete the sentences. For this one, we are going to have around five to seven minutes to complete, okay? Let's go and do this exercise. Accept my invitation to the small groups. Thank you very much. Accept my invitation. Thank you, thank you. Everybody's being sent to the small groups. Okay, I think everybody has accepted the invitations. And maybe, okay, I am going to go and check the different groups. Ana Maria, do you have any problem to connect on the group or you are in the other device? Okay, I move Ana Maria to the next group. Excellent. So right now we are going to go and check the different groups. Okay, Luis is connected, only Ana Maria is missing. Let's go and see what happens in room number five. Excellent, so all of them are assigned already. Let's go and check. Hello. 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 You can continue, I am here just observing. <laughs> <laughs> okay, there you have the sentences if you don't, didn't have them. Thank you. Okay, so if you didn't have them, now it's the moment for a screenshot. Okay. Thank you, I got it. Okay, great. I have the screenshot. Okay, so you have the first example, chocolate cake is more delicious than lemon pie. And then you have, is cheaper than, then you can have anything that you want to compare. You can say, for example, uh, I don't know, a banana is cheaper than an apple. 
and you have a sentence in my country, right? And you can create the rest of it, okay? I am going to leave for you to feel creative and I am going to check the next group. Go ahead. Okay. Thank you, teacher. And the number one, the dollar is cheaper than the Bitcoin in my country. Uh, repeat, please. Uh, the dollar is cheaper than the Bitcoin in my country. Just remember to take notes, okay? Take notes because later you have to report. I J J E R. Big, bigger or biggest? I don't know. Bigger W H. I don't know, but. At the big E a cerdo in español. Is a cerdo. No, big. No, it's, it's a big, a big grande. 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 Okay. Uh-huh. The. I think cerdo is big with P, letter P. The, 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 the dog is big than the cat. The dog is bigger than bigger. the cat. Okay, uh -huh, yeah. Uh, yeah, remember, yeah. bigger, bigger. bigger if if bigger. you have any difficulty understanding the sentences uh, on, the, on the microphone, remember that you can also share on the chat. You can also write them there. And remember to take notes because later when we come back, you have to report uh, the sentences that you created, okay? So continue working, continue working yeah. uh, and check them, check the spelling and everything. And I'm going to come back in a moment, okay? Teacher, okay. sorry. Uh, yes? Uh, about modern. Uh-huh. Uh, I think we, we, we are confused. It's, uh -huh. it's like the same modern. Yeah, but you have to use more, more modern. Uh huh. It's it's like modern. Oh, okay. Yeah, like moderno. <clears throat> okay. Thank you. You're welcome, hon. Okay. I can read in the chat. Give me another example about the modern. I for. Nation, Metira. <laughs> este, no, no, no sé qué poner ahí. A mí me parece que hay tem, pero no sé si será. Hello, hello. Eh, ¿Cómo se dice claveles? Claveles. I, I know, I know. They are carnation. 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 Yes, it's carnation. Carnation. You say C A R N A T I O N. Carnation. Yes. Modern. Modern. Yes. It's more modern. Okay. How many sentences do you have? Yes. You are almost finishing. Okay, I am going to go and check the last group. I am going to go and check the last group and I'm going to come back in a moment, okay? Continue, finish the sentences and take notes because you need to report. Tienen que reportar al regresar, así que take notes. Ya se me encuentra el tiempo. 
Okay. <laughs> no, I am just here to see uh, how are you doing? If you need anything, do you need help? Estamos in the, the tercera and are more expensive than. Ah, okay, good. Just remember to take notes, right? Remember to take notes because when you come back, you are going to report. Okay? I'm going to go to the next group. Continue working, don't worry. Okay. I am going to go to group number two. It's, it's more more, <laughs> more? Than, than my computer. I, I think it's more modern. You have to, to use more, it. Uh -huh. more modern. Good, very good That's job. That's my computer. Okay. And, and the last one, bigger, or oh, that's it. <laughs> Una preguntita, modern, ¿qué significa? More, ¿Por qué dijo more modern? No, okay. more modern, moderno, actualizado. Ajá. Ah, uh -huh. So you, you have to use more Perfect. because you are comparing. Ajá. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. As you, are, as you are comparing, you say it is more modern. Uh -huh. More modern uh, computer. Más moderno. Uh -huh. That's my computer. Yes. We finished. Uh, yeah, because okay. I am going to take you back in a second. <laughs> okay, so check, okay. please check your sentences because we are about to finish, okay? okay. I am going to go to the last group. Okay. And bigger, bigger. Bye. O las estaciones de que estaba diciendo William, eh, las seasons. Ah, este, ajá, seasons. ¿Cómo era? Primavera. Primavera, pero ¿cómo dice primavera en inglés? Spring. Spring. Spring is more beautiful than. Okay, winter, que invierno. Yeah. Entonces sería como la oración. Spring are more beautiful than winter. Spring or the spring? The spring. It's, it's only spring. A spring is more beautiful. You spring. don't say the spring. Only a spring is more beautiful than okay, uh, winter. Yeah. Y estaría bien decir competing is more beautiful than winning. Competing. Oh. competing, competing, competing is more beautiful than winning. Yes, yeah. it is possible. Yes, yes, I think it's possible. If you really enjoy that uh, competition feeling, you say competing is more beautiful than winning. Yes, I think it's okay. Yeah. Okay, people, okay. hurry up because we're only missing one minute. Okay. Finish the three that we are okay. missing. Okay. Bye bye. I am going to go with the last group. Bye bye. Okay. Stylish. Um, stylish. Okay, did you finish? Because we're going to go back to the general group. Yes? Yeah. Fantastic. Okay, so we're going to go back to the general group. So if you have to copy something from the chat, do it. We're going to go back.
Okay, welcome back. Welcome back, everybody. Excellent. So we have a lot of rain all over El Salvador. Yes. So I don't know if you can listen to the rain or is it okay, the audio? I think it's okay. Okay, perfect. So um, in the first sentence, I need one volunteer to tell me the sentence about cheaper. You can just raise your hand there in the in the camera, or you can open your microphone and give me a sentence. Rene Murillo, give me the one about cheaper. The microphone, honey. The, the dollar is cheaper than the Bitcoin in my country. <laughs> the dollar is cheaper than the Bitcoin in my country. Very good example. <laughs> The next one about taller. Who can help me with that one? Taller. Okay, me. Maria Delia, go ahead. Uh, Carlos is taller than Juan. Very good job. Excellent. Are more expensive than. Who can help me with that one? Hello, me. Edwin, go ahead. Uh, Pizza Hut is more expensive than Little Caesar. <laughs> okay, very good. Yes, excellent. And the commercial was not included, right? We are not receiving anything for the commercial. No, no, sorry. Uh, I'm hungry. <laughs> <laughs> that makes two of us. Because You're working I am... in the Little Caesar. Yeah, because no, it's... I... <laughs> yeah, I think, it is... I think everybody's hungry. <laughs> and it's difficult to study with hungry. <laughs> Being yeah, hungry. <laughs> yeah I, I know, I know. I know. Be careful. Be careful there on the car. The next one. Older than me. Go ahead, Claudia. Uh, the country music is older than rock music. Country music is older than rock music. Very good job. The next one, who can help me with the next one? Raise your hand if you can help me with the next one. The next one is beautiful. Maria. Is more beautiful uh, Beatriz, for example. Maria is more beautiful than Beatriz. Yeah, Beatriz, any Beatriz from the world. William Martinez, <laughs> William, help me with the next one. A stylish. This um, jacket is more stylish than this. Okay, can you repeat the example? This black jacket is more stylish than this blue shirt. Very good. Like the example of yesterday in the conversation. That's pretty awesome. Modern. Modern. Alicia, thank you. Modern. The microphone, Alicia. I was working on that one, teacher. <laughs> Claudia Roxana. Oh, bueno. Claudita. Claudita, Claudita, are you there? Oh, we lost Claudita. Let's see, Tania. Tania oh. Karina. No llegamos a esa. Oh, okay, okay. Luis Monzón, go ahead. The virtual. Okay, okay. My my cell phone is more modern than my computer. Excellent. My cell phone is more modern than my computer. And the last one, big. Santos Miguel, go ahead. Brazil is bigger than El Salvador. Brazil is bigger than El Salvador, but we are bigger on people. 
<laughs> so we are we are bigger on the feeling, right? We are bigger on love. <laughs> okay, excellent job. Well, my dear students, it has been such a pleasure to work with you this night. A very, very rainy night, but it is very nice that I have very dedicated students that are always working. So I am going to see you tomorrow in the next session, the last session before vacation. So please don't miss it. We are going to continue working on the next session of uh, the book. So please try to advance a little bit on this. Remember to advance on the platform and we should be working on section four already, okay? Ya tendríamos que ir adelantado en la sección cuatro. Así que pongámosle feeling si tienen alguna dificultad. Just let me know and we're going to be very glad to help you, okay? Okay. okay. Have a great Thank night. You. I am going to see you Good tomorrow. Night. Bye -bye. Good night. 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 Sleep well. Bye bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you. See you. Yes. Bye. Everybody. Take care. Thank you. Bye bye.